What's up? How are you guys this week? Another Monday down at Frankie's Free Range Meat. Another Monday of me being stuck in a labyrinth of boxes. But as usual, we have some new things going on this week. Uh, the fresh beef, or at least the rest of it, is shipping out this week, so we're kind of out. Uh, but with success at the reduced price point, uh, we'll probably be doing it more frequently every two weeks. Uh, the butcher will also be sending us the sausages and hot dogs that I mentioned last week, which will be available individually as part of the hot dog or sausage share. Uh, so definitely keep an eye out on the website Wednesday this week, guys, if you do want to try that as soon as possible. Typical of the dairy eggs coming in every week now, guys. We've got the corn and soy free, chicken, duck, and quail eggs, and all of the straight from the farm. A2, A2, grass-fed, straight from the farm dairy. We got the milk, butter, cream, kefir, yogurt, farmer's cheese, everything for the most part on the dairy end of things is in stock for you guys. Take a quick look at what's going on. We got a lot of egg orders shipping out for you guys. These are all the meat orders over here. So been busy Monday. I did want to show you guys, we got the really, really expensive double walled boxes for the eggs. You know, some of these boxes are like $10 each, which is crazy for cardboard, but absolutely no eggs should be breaking at all. I mean, with the strength of these boxes, you can practically jump on them and nothing will happen. So, you know, we shouldn't be having any more issues with the eggs. You know, I wonder if FedEx sees it as a challenge when they see three fragile stickers to see how hard they can throw the box. Hello? Hey, what's up, man? Everything is ready. Hold on, you should be able to pull up anyway. Uh, let me look outside. What's up, man? You got you let the post office through, okay? My business is right here. Yeah. The post the office. Farmers? They didn't let him through over there. They didn't let him through? No, that's what he said. So, all right. So either if he comes here, let him through. I'll tell them, okay. I'll tell them too, okay? Little intermission of me dealing with the construction outside, not letting the post office through, and my car is in the middle of the fucking street. I'm surprised they didn't hit it yet. All right, back to business. We showed you guys a few new things last week on the Frankie's Free Range Foods. We have the whole organic artichokes as well as the organic artichoke spread that you guys have been liking a lot. Pemmic is in stock. We're kind of running out of the biltong and the beef jerky. We got the Tatomi's bars. We got the new quinoa crisp bars, which are absolutely delicious. And we got a decent amount of pemmican for you guys. Flextrose is in stock. We got the salts. Frankie's steak seasoning for the most part. All the stuff on Frankie's Syringe Foods is available. I'll show you guys the fridge before we hop in the freezer because there's a few things we're out of. No roast beef this week, guys. This is from last week, I'm sorry, I forgot to order some, so um, we're refunding the roast beef for some people. This is the last of the, the beef shares. We have three here and five here, but I think those are all sold for already. Um, I will say, this, uh, this meat this time around tastes like it's straight from the farm. Very hay-like, a little bit gamey, but it's still very delicious and fresh. I think we're out of chicken eggs this week. We still got some duck eggs and some quail eggs left. Most of the dairy is sold. We sold all the milk. This is just some kefir that's left over here. Kefir grains did restock. Some of you guys were asking for them. Yeah, so if you guys can, you know, order the dairy as soon as possible every week. We're trying to reduce the, uh, the food waste, at least until we can get an ice cream machine or something to, to make the extra milk with over the weekend. So into the frozen abyss. We did get a big shipment in last week. Here's some uh, beef tongues, but it was mostly just beef belly and beef liver. Plenty of the affordable bison and 80, 20 ground beef around seven, eight dollars a pound. You guys haven't liking that. This is kind of new. We have cross cut short rib. These are available in two and a half pound portions. So you get three nice short ribs. Perfect for throwing on the grill. Now that it's getting a little warmer. This is the, uh, the five pound beef heart ground up that you guys can kind of use as pet food or for yourself if you want. We also got in a ton of beef heart. Unfortunately, these are a little larger. This is the whole heart. So it's like uh, five or six pound portions. Gigantic, good price per pound, but definitely a lot of beef heart. <laughs> and then we, so we have the whole beef heart and then we have all the ground up beef heart you could ever want. My guys chopped up plenty of beef bacon over the weekend, main thing we ran out of. And we do also have one pound beef belly portions too. 
Yeah, so the main thing last week is we just got a ton of beef liver and beef belly back in stock. If you guys do want the whole beef belly portions, let me know. Uh, I wasn't planning on doing that many because they're not that popular, but um, we can if you guys want to like make some bacon yourself or do like whole belly on the grill. Almost forgot, we finally restocked the marrow butter. So many of you guys have been emailing me for this and now we have a pretty good amount. So, you know, this is nice if you don't want to have to pick through the marrow bones, although it is a little expensive. Also, we might have to do a moving sale soon just to kind of reduce the inventory. So in conjunction with that, I might try to get like a bunch of the really like low priced and cheap like ribeye and strip steaks that you guys like. Not as good as the one inch thick cut we usually sell, but at like one third of the price, a lot of people still enjoy them a lot. So, so we might get some of those in and then do like a moving uh, big steak sale again just for the next month or two. Organ supplements, Wi-Fi shielding, Frankie's Naturals, no updates this week. Uh, maybe we'll be getting some new stuff in the next few weeks or few months. But yeah, definitely check out Frankie's Free Range Meat as well as Frankie's Free Range Foods because we do have a lot of new and interesting products that we've been adding every week to help you guys improve your health as well as get quality stuff at an affordable price. And you can see all of the businesses on frank-stefano.com. Thank you guys so much for joining me this week. If you could, please drop a like on the video leave a comment down below. Make sure to subscribe and check that notification bell and we'll see you guys soon.